So, you've clicked on this video because you want to learn how to increase your FPS in Minecraft. Either you're lagging, you're facing issues with your performance, and you want to learn how to make your gameplay smoother. I've compiled a list of things here that could help you out with your problem. The first thing you're going to want to do is, when you open Minecraft Launcher, specifically this is for Java Edition, you want to make sure that you are on the most stable version of Minecraft. The latest release, uh, 1.28.1, uh, this is fairly stable. It's not very glitchy, not very buggy, so you'll get very decent FPS on this version. But let's say you want to, uh, for even more stability, you want to head back to the the proper release, not the latest release. You want to, not, no snapshots. Snapshots are uh, usually buggy. So a release, a proper tested release would be 1.20.6 or 1.21. So it's fully released, it's uh, proper, it is out there, and it won't glitch as much. So um, to do that, I, I've just kind of skipped over this, but uh, when you're uh, on your Minecraft launcher to install a, a separate version, you want to head on over to Installation, New Installation, and you want to select one that says Release next to it, not Slapshot, not Latest, just Pure Release. Just like so, 1.20.6, you just want to name it, whatever, uh, we'll name it... Um, stable release and uh, you just want to leave everything on uh, automatic you just want to click create and you'll see that you just want to click on play and you'll be good um, and the next step would be to open the game itself i'll open the latest release simply because um my computer can run it i've experienced no issues so i'm just gonna run this all right while Minecraft boots up in the background, another thing would be to maintain and ensure that your graphics drivers are updated. So we're going to open GeForce Experience because that's um, my uh, graphics cards developer, NVIDIA. They make the graphics cards for me. I have an RDX 4090 in my computer. And uh, you'll see here, as it opens up, this would be what I will use to update my graphics drivers. I have not done so in a while. It is important and imperative to your own gaming experience that you keep your graphics drivers updated if you want a smooth and decent experience when you're playing games. So you'll see here that it opens. You want to head on over to the... Uh, I'm just going to close that out. You want to head on over to the drivers page. And you want to download uh, the the ready driver, this one right here. So it's game ready drivers. These are the most stable drivers that NVIDIA has to offer. You just want to click on download. It'll do that for you. It won't take too long. And that would be how to update your graphics drivers. The next thing we'll show you is uh, Minecraft settings itself and how exactly to optimize FPS from inside Minecraft. All right. So you'll see here that I am in a Minecraft world, and um, uh, my render distance is quite large, right? Um, and you'll notice some kind of choppiness. You'll see that the frames are dropping. If I click F3 on my keyboard, you'll see that I currently have 600 frames. Even so, there can be some choppiness when you're rendering in new chunks. Minecraft has chunks, and when you walk towards a new one, you will notice some type of lag. I'm currently on 700 FPS purely because my computer is very good. I have a fairly um, beefy PC that can run a lot of things. So that is why I have that. Some people would have lesser, uh, le lesser FPS. They would not be able to run things as efficiently as I can. Um, but we'll show you how to go over uh, ways to increase that frame limit. So the first thing I'll recommend is to actually reduce the FPS. Right? You don't want your max frame rate to be unlimited. You want it to be set to 140, 120, depending on your computer. You can have it six, uh, set to 90 or 60, uh, depending on your computer itself. I'll set mine to 140, because that is the maximum frames. You, your computer will not show you past 140 frames per second. Uh, there's no point to 800 frames. That's just, you know, for show. Um, after you've done that, this would be in your video settings. I forgot to mention, you have to open your settings, pressing escape, go to options, video settings, and in here you want to decrease your maximum frame rate. Next, you'll want to decrease your render distance to 8 chunks and simulation distance to 8 chunks. You don't need it to be that hot. You do not need 12 chunks. The farthest you'll be able to see is right there. You'll see that it's a nice fog. You won't get any um, weird glitching or cutoff uh, pixels. It looks nice, it's decent, and it will give you a decent boost in frames. As you can see, I'm getting a solid 138 frames. It's not decreasing much, and I'm not lagging quite a bit. 
Now let's say your computer is not that good. You want to keep maximum frame rate to about 80 or 90. We'll keep it at 80. You want to turn off your VSync right here, VSync on. You want to turn that off. Graphics from fancy to uh, fast. You want to make sure that your uh, full screen is on, just like so. Um, because this, make sure that your computer is fully focused on Minecraft right now. So once you've done that, you want to turn off your clouds as well. Clouds off, so that will decrease all the clouds in the sky. You have nothing there. They're all gone. This increases performance. Obviously, it's not necessary that you do this, but um, I'm going to just unfold screen out of Minecraft. It's not necessary that you do that. You don't have to turn off your clouds, but certain things like that can improve your frames. Right, uh, the next would be to, I don't recommend this one, especially, it would be to decrease your resolution, right here. I'm not going to mess with this, but you can, you can strength, you can make it so that your computer, you play in a small window, um, like this, you could do that. Uh, Minecraft will have a better time at running if it's windowed like this, for some players, uh, because your computer has to spend less energy, uh, put in less effort into rendering every single pixel, because it's smaller. So that would be how to uh, reduce your lag. Minecraft has a lot of different uh, settings that allow you to do stuff like this. You can even install different mods that optimize your, uh, your graphics for you. You won't suffer too much. And that would be how to decrease your lag in Minecraft. How to get better FPS. And uh, if you're facing any issues with your Minecraft, if other things are happening, do let me know in the comments. I will be happy to help you. And I will catch you guys in a different time.